Hi guys! So today I want to discuss the important benefits of brushing your hair every day. Yes, at least once or twice a day, please. And I'll tell you why. I've recently come to discover that most of us are not brushing our hair daily, but why not? There are many amazing results that you can achieve just by simply brushing your hair. Personally, the very first thing I do when I wake up is brush my hair. It instantly revives me and lifts my mood. So let's get down to the benefits. Brushing your hair stimulates blood flow to the scalp, which enables healthy hair growth. Yay! Uh, it can improve your overall hair condition, but please be mindful not to be aggressive. Excessive brushing can cause damage to the scalp and hair follicle. So please always be gentle with your beautiful locks. Brushing your hair literally brushes all the dirt away from your scalp, which helps to prevent many hair problems. But what dirt would be building up in our hair? We touch our hair a lot more than I think we realize, first of all, so that creates excessive oil buildup. But then there's also many factors such as uh, air pollution, which just naturally by wind puts dirt in your hair, metals in the water, sun exposure, so you've got the heat damage from the UV rays drying out your hair because it's quite harsh conditions actually swimming as well whether it be chlorine or sea salt water it can be a, a lot of damage more than we realize just by external factors never mind also internal factors such as diet alcohol consumption uh, lack of exercise etc using products that help to strengthen hydrate or nourish your hairs can make a huge difference okay brushing also helps to combat frizz distributes natural oils down your scalp and Emulates your scalp. Okay, so here's my top tip. Brush your hair morning and evening to achieve beautiful hair results. Another top tip is to keep a detangling spray very nearby to your brush or mirror. Just create that habit. You know, you don't brush your teeth without toothpaste. So it's the same thing. When you brush your hair, pop in a detangling spray heat protector. This will assist you in brushing out any painful knots which will help keep the process a lot more gentle and calming for you and your hair follicles. Because the minute we aggravate them, uh, they feel it. We need to be very gentle and give extra love and care to our beautiful little follicles. This will leave you with effective results. That leave your hair feeling silky soft and luscious. Right, so you must be thinking, okay, she's bonkers. Let's get down to straightforward facts. That blood flow is improved, which means that extra oxygen is starts to flow, which provides nutrients for your hair and scalp. By having nourished roots, this in turn promotes healthy hair growth. So I know some of us also suffer a lot more from an oily scalp, but if you brush your hair, this is gonna help you to distribute the oils down your hair and onto your ends. That's why sometimes you have an oily scalp and drier ends because you're not getting the oils traveling down. Um, curly hair, especially as well, the way the hair shaft is shaped, it just, the oil is unable to travel down, gets stuck. So that's why curly hair needs more intensive nourishing products on your beautiful ends. Back to the brush. Did you know that dead skin cells can build up on your scalp if you do not brush your hair? I don't think anybody wants that. Not only does it not sound great, but this buildup can clog your hair follicles, thus hinders new growth. Not good. The same is um, with over excessive use of products, dry shampoo, gels, waxes. You really need to do two shampoos to make sure you're cleaning your scalp thoroughly. So how do we achieve a well-nourished and healthy scalp? We need to activate our sebaceous glands by brushing. <laughs> Our sebaceous glands are very important because they are what creates our natural oils on our scalp. That is why we need to show some extra love and care for them. So brushing enables moisture to travel down your hair shaft with your natural oils, which helps to combat frizz. As frizz is normally caused by extreme dryness. So those natural oils are there for a reason. Our natural oils are very important. That is also why you don't want to 
overwash your hair and remove these natural oils because what happens is then your body tries to compensate and it says where are my oils where are my oils you keep washing them out so it produces more and more and more and more and you end up with a more oily scalp so try not to wash your hair at least for two days try up to three it will be hard at first but once you overcome the habit your body will adjust back to normal and love you for those beautiful oils Please brush your hair at least once or twice per day, please. You won't regret it. Build it into your routine. It doesn't take extra time. You're gonna feel great. Your hair's gonna love you as well. And it'll just be beneficial overall. Plus, brushing your hair just feels so amazing and can be oh so therapeutic. So why not get brushing now, you know? Oh, love it. Oh, it feels so good. All right, well, I hope these little hair tips helped. If you do have any further questions, just reach out, send me a message, and I will gladly assist. All right, have a beautiful day. Thanks for watching. Bye.